Hey guys, it's me Lexi and welcome back to my channel for another new Let's Play. So today we're starting the Legacy Challenge. Um, if you guys remember a long, long time ago, I had a Legacy Challenge and a lot of you guys loved it. Um, so I decided I would bring it back, kind of obviously like a new sim, whole new like vibe, but like same Let's Play. So this is Diana. She, Diana Winchester. And she went off to college when she was 18. Her parents paid her tuition, her room, and her food. And they weren't rich by any means, but they made sure to save that money from the time she was born to the time she turned 18. So that way they could pay for her stuff. Um, and they were humble. I mean, they were comfortable, but they were by no means rich. Diana wanted to pursue a career in business and her parents thought that was a fantastic idea she's always been such an opportunist such she's really good with her words um although she is good with her words and she's very charismatic in high school she wasn't popular she wasn't um noticed really by any guys she never really had a boyfriend she messed around with a few guys but she never like got into anything serious with them she always ended up cutting them off because she got bored um because she's Daniela she's a baddie but she's obviously gorgeous she always wore like not raggedy ass clothes like she always had what she needed um but she just wasn't social like other girls at her school so when she got to college, she promised herself that she'd become more of a social butterfly and to come out of her shell. And she did just that. She ended up becoming quite the little party girl and she went to every party possible when she got there. She even tried to join the sorority, which is what she was working towards. Um, of course, with this new lifestyle, she ended up late to almost all of her classes and or she skipped them all together and she was up late every single night and she started to fail her classes and her parents of course got a phone call from the school letting them know if she didn't fix her grade she would soon be dropped from her classes her parents told her about this phone call but diana didn't stop partying she started going to classes more because she thought oh if i go to class i can catch up but she was so far behind from not showing up that she ended up failing because she could not catch up so when the semester ended she was dropped from the school. She wasn't allowed back in until she seeked help. And by that, I mean like AA meetings because they knew of her ways, got around obviously from the school and her parents refused to let her come back to their house and live off them. So she ended up moving to a city, um, that's somewhat far away because she did live in a smaller town and she just wanted more opportunities and more friendships. So we moved to the city of Saffron Bay with 250 bucks to our name. So we have nothing here. I wanted to give her no money, like extra no money because I thought it'd be more fun like to have the idea that that's all she had was 250 bucks. And these were the clothes that she was wearing. I know she's kind of stunting on them, but I don't care. I love her. Um, and I love this fit. I just downloaded the CC. It's on my Tumblr. If you want to go get it, it's there. Um, so with that being said, we need to make some money today. Uh, I'm really excited to start this let's play because I've always done legacy challenges since the time I like really got into the Sims 3 from now even like I love 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 legacy challenges i've never completed one probably the closest i've gotten was my generations let's play so we'll see how this goes um obviously we have no money but i just i'm curious to know how much a tent is oh we can actually afford a tent so we're gonna go ahead and buy one um and i want to place it so that way i can um edit it the way i want it to look hold on now i need to look I need the good good. Let's see. She, I'll tell you about her personality. Sorry. It's like 12 a.m. when I'm filming this because I'm not tired at all. I know I just yawned, but I promise you I'm not tired. I don't know what the hell I just clicked on. Anyways, um, yeah, I'm not tired at all. 
I slept until noon today and then I woke up, I did my essay and then I worked on generation stuff like literally the whole day. And it took me so long to get it like where I needed it to be. Um, it, obviously it's not really perfect, but I was so excited that I just didn't want to wait anymore. Um, so I ended up recording. I actually like the grass texture. Like it doesn't really look like grass, but it's really pretty. So Diana is flirty. She's a night owl. She's hot headed. She's a klepto and she's charismatic. She likes pop music, hamburgers, pink, and she's a Scorpio like me. Yee. Um, she has no scales or anything like that. Oh god. I literally haven't yawned once tonight. So, of course, when I start recording, I'm going to start yawning. Um, I chose this lot right here. It's not a 64 by 64. And I, I'm i going to, like, loosely follow legacy challenge rules. Like, I don't really care that much. Um, actually, I'm really not going to follow them at all. Like, I'm just going to kind of do my own thing. But um, I liked this lot because it's not huge. So, I can still, like, build a nice house and like with the backyard and the pool and all that good stuff when we have the money. And not have a shit ton of extra space. Plus, it's really close to the junkyard. Um, and it's close to town and I didn't want to live cause I was going to choose this one actually, but it's like super lumpy and huge and I just don't like that, but I've already placed her man and I've placed other Sims. I placed Keegan Sims. If you know his let's play or his legacy, legacy challenge, you definitely need to go watch it. If you haven't, it's really good. I've almost caught up on it. I have one more video to watch and I'm going to watch it tonight when I lay down. Um, yeah, I freaking started that this morning, and I was like, wow. I was watching that while I was what, or, uh, writing my essay. I was like, hell yeah. I'm really excited. I'm super into The Sims right now, and I'm super into YouTube. Like, I've just... When I was uploading my video earlier, I literally sat there and just, like, waited for it to upload, and I never do that. Um, I've never done that, actually, in my life of YouTube, but I was so excited for it to come up for you guys. And I'm just happy to be back because I feel really inspired right now. And I just want to record and make content because that always makes me happy. And, like, I don't know about you guys, but the winter time, I don't know how my game is, like, lagging so bad right now. The winter time is always so fucking hard for me. Like, I, I don't know what it is, but as soon as, like, late November hits or even early November this year. Um, I just go down like a fucking spiral. But we're going to go ahead and create an online dating profile. I want to go ahead and get ourselves out there as a single woman looking for love and also to rob you. Um, there's not very many Sims in this world right now. I'm going to have to play some. Um, my game's still like kind of loading everything in. So I think that's why it's lagging. I hope you guys can hear the sound. I realized in generations you literally couldn't hear it at all. So, I don't know why that is, but when I was streaming, you couldn't hear Keegan at all either. This is the man I made. Oh, Ezra. I made him off fucking Ezra off of Pretty Little Liars. It, <laughs> His name's Ezra Fitz. Um, I know. He's going to be a teacher. Actually, I need to give him the teacher career if he's, like, outside. If he's not, I'm going to spawn him outside because... Um, I don't want him to get, like, a stupid-ass career. Hold on. Where are you, Mr. Ezra? Oh, here he is. Here he is. Uh, Sonny. I want to meet him by chance, too. Like, I don't want to just pull up to his house. Like, I want to meet him by chance, because... I'm not in a rush with her at all. Like, I don't really care how many kids she has. Even if it's just one, I'm cool with that. Preferably two, <laughs> at least. Prostitute. <laughs> um, where is the education career? But yeah, he's super hot. Um, I worked for probably like an hour on him. And to be honest, he looks a lot like my other Sims, but... Um, I tried to do something else, but also I haven't made a sim in, I don't, like a male sim, and I don't know how long. Female sims, obviously I still got it. Look at her, she's a baddie. At first I was like, I don't like her at all. 
and then I like I don't know what hit I think I changed like her jaw and I was like hey I'm in love with her um let's make a baby like look at her are you fucking kidding me how can you not just be in love with that like ugh, she's so beautiful so I think today I don't really know what to do to be honest with you maybe honestly we just need to make money uh, we need a toilet and a shower hopefully by the end of the day but I don't know if that's gonna happen so we're gonna go to the um, park because sometimes they have flowers there I don't know if they will this soon but yeah also this world is from my sims reality it's my favorite world and all the shits spawning in so this is probably why my game is lagging so badly um, just go into my inventory. I'm not going to sell you. Although you're so tempting. I'm not going to sell you. Okay. Oh, there's some flowers here. We'll make some good money. Go ahead and pick that. Who's this? Anderson? Don't know you. Um, let's see. Is there any other flowers that are worth our time? Not really. I didn't think there would be that many. I mean, it's literally 1030 in the morning. Let's go ahead and pick these other ones. Um, she wants to meet someone online. I placed a bunch of females, too, because I really want her to have a lot of friends. I mean, her lifetime wishes to be super popular because, like I said in her backstory, like, she wasn't the popular girl at school at all. Like, she literally... Obviously, she was beautiful back then, too, but she just was so, like, antisocial. Like, she did not give a shit. Um, here's Davian Allen. He's really hot. I don't know if he's single or anything like that, but we're about to find out. And this is um, Juniper Harding. She's one of my sims that I had in a lepasy of mine, and she went off to Showtime and was a singer, and she's really beautiful and gives me Doja Cat vibes. Love her so much. Um, it should be pretty easy to get this lifetime wish done because she, um, or I have the freaking deep conversations mod and that makes my life so much easier. I freaking love that mod. Um, oh, he's single. Hey, King. Um, I'm not afraid to mess around a little bit. Like I don't, I, I, there's no need to rush into settling. Although, if we do meet him, I might rush because I'm literally in love with him and I want him to marry me. But, yeah. I swear to God, I just stay falling in love with the Sims. Like, bitch, fall in love in real life and get a group. Okay. Um, let's compliment him. Where did Juniper go? Oh, she's skating. Okay, I'll let her do her thing for a minute. Let's make a silly face. Um... I don't know which one's good. I think that one maybe? Do we know Ezra now? Nope. I thought if we talked about him, we might know him, but we don't. Okay, let's ask him about his age, gossip, and <laughs> worry about money. No, I don't know if you would like that. We'll just talk about the heat because it's hot outside. But yeah, she's looking very spicy. I think when spring or when fall rolls around, we'll give her a much more chill look, if you will. Not so... Um, I'm a bougie bitch and daddy paid my car payment for me for as long as I can remember. Um, look to her, you know, but I love this freaking outfit so much and I literally seen it and I was like, okay, this top, a look. And then I seen the skirt and it's like the freaking X's are like kind of like a pink tint and I was like, okay, bitch, I need this in my life. So, I gave that to her. Okay, let's go ahead and introduce ourselves to Juniper. Because she wants to become friends with 20 people. I don't even know, like, how easy that's going to be, to be honest with you. Because I definitely didn't place 20 people. Um, and this world is unpopulated. So, we'll see. Um, let's ask her all these stupid questions that I just like to get out of the way. Oh, she's in the singer career, even in here. Cool. We are the exact same age. Wild. She wants to flirt with somebody, and she wants to go to the bookstore. We literally don't have money to go to the bookstore, so just go ahead and get rid of that. Like, don't even think about it. She's a Libra. Um, 
let's high five. Oh, she's clumsy. Can we like apologize? Cause I want to become besties with you. I don't need the arguments. <laughs> okay, I don't. Um, let's shock a bra. I haven't even made a thumbnail for this let's play. Like I want to go um, with a new type of way with my thumbnails for this let's play. Like perhaps a new thumbnail with every um, what's it called every episode but I don't know if I'm ready for all that like that sounds like a lot of work to me but also I think it would look really cute but I don't know because it wouldn't really match my theme with my other let's play you know what I mean so it's like ooh, debatable so tomorrow I'm gonna make it and then when I upload this I guess we'll just see so we have like flowers spawning everywhere we're just gonna pick all of them Hopefully we can buy a toilet. Oh, a Cosmo, Cosmo, Cosmo. Bitch, we buying a toilet. We buying a toilet. Okay, we might go home after we pick all those. Um, who's this? Oh, hi. He was like my next contender. So me, oh my God, his name's Ezra. That's hilarious. There's two Ezra's. This is actually uh, Julia Sim that was born in game and I just think he's really cute like he has different facial features than one I would normally make my son look like but it, he's still so freaking cute and I love him and yeah I will definitely be his friend if not anything like romantic Let's see how much money we made two grand bitch that's right hey Ask him about his career. Um, ask him about his age. Ask his sign. Alma mater. Ask him if he's single. And then we'll probably go home after that. Um, she has a little bit of a late night owl. Or late night owl. Whatever the fuck. But <clears throat> I want to keep her on a decent schedule for right now. Because we're going to have to get up pretty early so we can go do stuff. Oh, we have compatible signs. We're gonna become friends already. Bitch, this deep conversations mod is so nice. Oh my gosh, okay. Compliment him. Um, yes, let's be friends. Look, we already have three friends, y'all. Literally get on my level. Um, you know what? Let's actually go in here and use this all-in-one bathroom while we're here because we can go ahead and get a shower in. So hopefully we won't be stink ass in the morning. We'll see. Probably still be a little stink ass. Um, as for food, I don't really know. None of those are harvestable. Maybe we can come over here and just like order up some food because we have some money. So we can just order like something from the concessions. Confession. Oh my god, confession stand, imagine. Look at how beautiful this freaking world is. Oh, I love it. I love worlds that like offer that like suburban area and then like countryside and also like the city side. Freaking tickles my pickle. Um Okay, what's like the cheapest thing you got on here? Uh Get onion rings. Bro, can you chill? We should have joined this, damn it. Maybe we can go to a bar because it's still kind of early and I don't want her to just go home. Like, what's the point? Um. But, like, somewhere close, maybe? I mean, she is, like, low-key an alcoholic, so I definitely want to see her, like, at the bars more than I would most Sims. Because that's kind of just the way she is, and we have to fix her, and that's okay. So, we have a tent. Um, I don't want to go crazy with, like, a whole ass, like, house, because two grand is not going to get us that, to be honest with you. So, I'm just going to go ahead and... <laughs> 
get what we need and go from there. We'll get that. Maybe we can get a little Shanae. Hell yeah, we can. And a fridge. Let's get a mini fridge. Mm. We'll do that. And then I really want to sink. I really want to sink. Might have to do another wall. Which I'm okay with. We can actually put that over there. I don't know. I think they come in from the left though. Hold on. I'm pretty sure they do. If not, then I can just switch it around. Uh, let's put up some wall coverings maybe. So she doesn't like dislike that. So let's do this one. Like it fucking matters. I know. Ooh, actually. <laughs> I'm just going to go through them all, I guess. Okay, so we'll put the fridge over here, and then we can put a counter down. I know this is absolutely hideous, but I don't really give a shit. Actually, you know what? Let's do this. Let's be smart about it, okay? And let's get a little mirror. <laughs> let's get this ghost mirror. No, it's literally a dollar. Um, I want something a little trashy, like her memories from university or something like that. I think that's kind of cute. And what else do we need? I kind of want her into painting. I do have a plan for her in the future. Um, but for right now, I think we'll just do some painting to get our funds up a little bit in the meantime when we're not stealing stuff. <clears throat> yeah, that's cute. I mean, it's hideous, but it's cute, you know? Maybe get some, like, trees of some sort so it's not just, like, bare naked over here. What is this one? Maybe I just need some sort of foliage because I feel like it's so weird how naked it is. Oops. Um. Okay, that's good enough. I don't want to go crazy because, like, I'm not trying to make it beautiful. I just don't like how freaking naked it was. Actually, you know what? Hold on. I'm sorry. <laughs> I need some freaking dirt. <sighs> I literally cannot stand foliage without dirt around it. Like, I don't know what it is. Like, I watched Little Simsy's How to Build once, okay? I can't do this anymore. I need dirt. Even if it's ugly. Okay, we're good now. Like a little area, just for a little bit more privacy. So I just don't like it when it's so open. It just doesn't make that much sense to me. Alright. We don't have anything else to sell, so... I mean, we have those items, but I'm not going to sell them. I feel like it's kind of cheaty. So, is there anyone here? No. Okay, cool. Who's this? She's a proprietor. Um, let's come over here and order a spine reticulator because it's only five dollars and we can afford that she of course is going to try to stop drinking but for right now she has not much else she needs something or someone perhaps to help her get through these tough times if you will what'd you get i don't even know what she did all right but we're gonna go home after this because it's starting to rain and i just think she needs to get home and go to bed. She's kind of sleepy, so uh, if we stay up till 11, I think we would get that stay up past bedtime. I think that's technically the technical part of it, I guess. I don't know. But yeah, we are in bed, and I'm going to go ahead and end this part here, you guys. I hope you all enjoyed it. I know nothing really happened, but that's just the first part. Got much more to come, so I love you guys, and thank you all so much for watching and sticking with me through hard times. I love you guys, and I'll see you all next time. Bye, everybody.